Hello everybody! So today, because the fact that I haven't done a video yet for like a week and a half, I don't think, um, I promise I am doing the Ipsy video. I just have not had time to sit down and film a video. I've been just running at a million miles a minute and <laughs> so today what I'm gonna do is I am going to show you guys two little small hauls that I got um, over the last couple of days because I happened to be able to during like a small like 30 minute break from doing all the stuff I've been doing go to the store like two times um so first haul I got I got because I traded in a bunch of stuff at a local used game store um so what I got for that was um don't want to drop this okay I got this keyboard for my PS4, which I'm super excited about because now I can finally start playing Elder Scrolls online again, um, and not be feeling like I was not in communication with anybody. Um, I hate the fight, I hate how, like, the mic, when you're, uh, trying to play, you have to be either right up on somebody's character or you have to be in a party with them in order to talk to them. Um, so it makes it kind of hard to make friends on there unless you have a keyboard, because by the time I finally type out anything, it's like... It, it makes no sense anymore because people have said so many things since then. Um, the other thing that I got was actually I pre-ordered um, the Crash Bandicoot uh, remake, well not remake, but enhanced like game for Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3, which I'm super excited about. That comes out in June, on June 30th, I believe. And I am so excited. Me and my cousin played that game nonstop growing up because my cousin lived with me. And... I told her, like, as soon as I pre-ordered, I was like, how much do you love me? And she's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, guess what I just pre-ordered for us to play for, like, two days straight. And she's like, what? And I'm like, Crash Bandicoot. She's like, hells yeah. But anyway, so got those. And then I also got Grand Theft Auto V, finally. I am super excited about that. I've been wanting that game since it came out. And I've just not been willing to spend, like, 50 bucks on it. But since I traded in a bunch of stuff, and I had $150 worth of in-store credit, I figured, why not? So, I also, I still have, like, 30-something dollars left. So, I'm going to be going back probably tomorrow, the next day, or sometime this weekend, um, when I'm on a small break again, to get either Final Fantasy 15 or something else that me and my friends agree would be a good game to play that we can all play together because I just found out that two of my best friends that live in other states have PS4s now and I am super excited to finally be able to play with them. So, now that the gaming hall is done, um, now for the beauty hall. Um, so, everybody knows I keep talking about the fact that I want to eventually... <laughs> Sometime soon, chop all this off and donate it. Um, now, uh, whether or not I get brave enough to do that or not is up in the air. I'm hoping to do it within the next couple of months before it gets, like, too hot so that if I decide to immediately grow it out to donate again, which I'm pretty sure I'm going to do, um, it will be long enough by winter time that it covers a little bit. Um, but I want to do a pixie cut. And so, first of all, I have not dyed my hair since um, December 24th. So the day before Christmas. So my roots are growing out quite well, as you can see. Um, and I'm getting tired of the fact that my roots are that long. And then the rest of it is all black, but it's like fading. So like in some areas it's brown. So, I got curious, and I got a gift certificate for Christmas, so again, this is not money that I spent just to spend money. Um, I've been doing research on different, like, color remover things, and I found Joyco Color Erase. So you guys know that I usually use the Ion stuff, and so since I had this uh, gift certificate, I decided that I was going to go ahead and try out the Joyco Color Erase. It's meant for um, semi-permanent hair colors or um, direct dyes, 
and people have, I've seen videos where people have used it on permanent hair color and it has worked very well. It's less damaging than the other stuff that I normally use and it smells good whereas the other stuff stinks. So for $2.50 each because of the fact that I can go to Cosmoprof, um, I got two packs of that and then I also got um, some Joyco Lumishine. Um, 20 volume because that is what is required to go along with the Joyco color and in, uh, intensity eraser which I will be filming this and unless my camera screws up um, that will be up on YouTube eventually I can't guarantee when um, and then because of the fact that there was a I don't know where I put the bag but anyway there was a buy this bag for $14 and get two of the bedhead uh, TG manipulators for $14 and that's pretty daggone good considering normally one of them at Cosmoprof is like 11 so I was super duper excited about that especially since I wanted to give these a try for styling on my mannequin heads on my boyfriend's hair and then on top of that when I end up finally getting a pixie, um, I'm going to need products because, yeah, the products that I have will work, but they're not specifically meant for doing what I'm going to want to do to my hair, whereas these are. So I am super excited about that. The consistency of them, I was expecting, like, the consistency of, like, a wax or something. But instead, let me put my camera like that there okay so instead the consistency is like a goop it's it smells really good but like it's goopy mmm smells so good but anyway yeah so those are my two little mini hauls there and so I spent well I spent like with okay so with the uh, gift certificate I spent I think like 27 something or no 26.50 or something like that at uh at Cosmoprof and I spent um 40-something for pre-ordering, I think it's like 49, for pre-ordering um, Crash Bandicoot, and then I spent 60-something for buying the keyboard and Grand Theft Auto V. So, all in all, two super awesome little mini hauls. And I'm so excited about them. I started playing Grand Theft Auto V, and so far really like the game. Um, might end up doing some streaming with that. Uh, I don't know yet. Uh, it depends on uh, exactly how long I have to play on it each time I play. If it's like 20 minutes or something like that, I can totally do the stream because then people won't get bored. But anyway, <laughs> um, so I, like I said before, I've been super busy and I'm going to continue being busy for a little while, but bear with me. I will be posting, like I said, one video a week at least um, to make sure that you guys have something. And they'll probably be kind of like vlogs. Um, so anyway, I will talk to you guys later. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'm also going to be working on trying to wear at least some lipstick lip, uh, lipstick eyeliner and mascara and somewhat doing my eyebrows from now on every day. So we'll see how that goes. I don't know how much faith I have in myself. But anyway, <laughs> I hope you guys know I enjoyed the video and I shall see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for every course.